All right, goal for today, gentlemen, is to spend as much time as possible outside. I really need to go to the grocery store, but I think the girls are okay. going to have to go hungry again tonight because that's <laughs> just not happening. Sorry, right. kids. Yeah. Sorry, kids. You, you don't want to spend an hour and a half in a big box no store, you know, way. on a day like this. Be outside as much <clears throat> right. as possible. Hold it off till Thursday when the temperatures start <laughs> right. to cool off a little bit. We'll be ordering pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a plan. I right? like it. All righty. Good morning, everybody. A little bit of fog out there. Uh, Augusta has some dense fog. We had uh, Sean Stackhouse's uh, camera a little while ago, and the, the state house was all, you know, kind of shrouded in, in clouds. Freiburg also, but it's not as big of a problem as it was yesterday. And it's not going to take as long to burn off as it did yesterday either. Now, it is pretty chilly, though, over southern Maine. Frosty spots down in Sanford area, Springville, Alfred, Freiburg, you've got some frost, too, in the Saco Valley. But northern Maine, it's actually balmy. Bangor's 47, Greenville is 56, normally and usually the cold spot in the state on a morning like this. All right, back to the west we look, we've got a front. This is going to bring an end to this very warm stretch that we've been experiencing, but we have today and tomorrow to enjoy before these showers come through and chill us down. Pockets of fog, not a problem for your commute, though. It should be a pretty smooth drive for you, unless, you know, with the time change, We've got sunrise occurring now during the commute, so there is that solar glare factor now. Lots of sunshine midday, temperatures popping into the 60s, and we'll top out in the low 70s, sunny and dry. And if you're doing a little raking or, you know, exercising outside, and if you can avoid the breeze and you're in the direct sun, at times it's actually going to feel kind of hot for this time of the year. You know, the sun, the temps in the 70s, yeah, that's pretty warm. 70 in Bangor today, 73 Lewiston, 72 Portland, even warmer as you get closer to New Hampshire, places like Sanford, the Berwicks, down into Elliott, you're looking at a high of like 60, 76 rather, 77 warm temperatures over in New Hampshire too. I think the most impressive though out of all of this, uh, the temps up in northern Maine, Caribou and Greenville and Rangeley, there's still a little snow up here, that's gone, that is gone by the end of today. Now, 72 in Portland would set a record. It will actually shatter it. It was set back in 09, 64 degrees. There's a very long standing record in Bangor going back to 1931. It's 68 and we're going to beat it today too. We top out at 70 and I think we get another opportunity to hit some records tomorrow. Another round of them. The records to fall tomorrow are 65 for both cities and we should get to the upper 60s. And then this front comes through with some scattered showers and more importantly, a chill down heading into the weekend. It'll be quiet, no storms. We miss one to the south, so that's good. We'll have partly sunny skies for the end of the week and the weekend, but it'll be a lot colder around here. If you're hoping for a good soaking as this front comes through, sorry to say it's not gonna happen. The heavier rain comes close, but ends up just a little short. Maybe we get a quarter of an inch of rain down in York County, but a lot of the state, it's just widely scattered showers, just a little bit of wet weather. Marine forecast sees two to three feet and southwest winds 10 to 20 knots. Water temp 51 hanging in there actually went up at a couple of degrees. I saw a dip into the upper 40s two days ago. Mostly sunny record highs in the low 70s. Tomorrow increasing clouds. More records will fall though. And then we get showers to come through. They'll exit Thursday morning and the temperatures begin their slide. 60 on Thursday, still mild, but 52 on Friday, partly sunny. Bright and sunny on Saturday, but 48. And then on Sunday, there'll be some chilly rain showers in the afternoon, probably mixed with some snowflakes for the terrain, the foothills in the mountains by Sunday afternoon and evening, guys. Okay. That's normal. Okay, yeah, it is. This is not. <laughs> normal is way overrated. Yeah, normal stinks. We established so, yeah, that one. Spend a few ago. minutes with this program. <laughs> exactly. <laughs>